Hi there. The recovery mode is very useful if you wish to reset your iDevice back to factory settings. Now it's advisable to do a backup beforehand because this process will wipe the device of all photos, apps, music, etc. Okay, with that said, what we'll need to get into the recovery mode is a computer with iTunes and iTunes up, a USB cable and your iDevice. So with one end of the USB cable connected to the computer, grab your iDevice and the other end of the cable. We need to press and hold the home button on your device, keep that held down and insert the cable. So we just pop that in like so. What you'll notice is the Apple logo come up and that's shortly followed by the USB to iTunes logo. This signifies that you are now in recovery mode. So we pop that down on the screen on iTunes. Uh, it says iTunes has detected an iPod in recovery mode. You must restore this iPod before it can be used with iTunes. Click OK. This point here, you can press restore iPod. This will restore your iPod. It does take some time, um, but that's the button to press and you just be patient and let that run through. Now, if for some reason you've changed your mind and you don't want to do a restore, simply disconnect the cable, then press and hold the home button and the power button together, like so. Screen goes blank, release both buttons, then press the power button at the top. You'll see the Apple logo come up and your device will boot back uh, and be as it was before you started the process. So I hope that's helped. Uh, thank you for watching and good luck with your device. Thanks a lot. Goodbye.